happening, Professor? We're in one of Lucy's capillaries and we found the source of her illness. It's a virus. So what medicine can I... can she take? Oh, none. Antibiotics only fight bacteria, not viruses. What am I... she, she, what am she going to do about it? There's nothing we can do. We just have to let her body's own defences handle it. Dentritic cells closing in fast, Professor. It's Lucy's dentritic cells. They collect samples of the virus and take them to the lymph nodes to be analysed. We should be OK, as long as they don't think we're part of the problem. Professor, come in. Professor, what are you going to do about my illness? That is so unprofessional. Lucy, are you OK? Run, VT. Cue applause. Bring on the band. Lucy, wake up. You're sleep producing. Stop, VT. Uh, cancel applause. Uh, unplug the band. You know, when I'm not feeling myself, what I like to do is take myself home, wrap myself up in my original packaging, and go for a nice long return for service. That sounds nice, but I can't. I once had to have a day off when I was at school. I was in a woodwork group, and we were supposed to be presenting a project to the class. Everyone was counting on me to organise that presentation. And I was at home, selfishly vomiting. They got a B plus. It was all my fault. From that day onwards, I swore I was never going to call in sick again. I'm the only thing holding this show together. Thank goodness you're here. I don't want to think how badly the show would be going without you. Why? What's happening? No. What is it? Nothing. Prepare yourself for an insane look at what they don't tell you in the science books. From inner space to the universe, we're on a case to face the worst. It's icky and it's whiffy and it's yucky and it's squishy, but we love it.